then obviously we'll be looking to shoo the knight away because don't really know what it's doing there so it's only got one space really safe that it can go to it's looking to compound some pressure maybe so just basically looking to shoo the knight away the strategy is well okay smaller piece attacking a higher piece can't be wrong and again maintaining pressure towards a higher piece with a lesser piece seeing where the bishop wants to go does it want happy sitting here then it's kind of getting trapped in a little bit so it might be that um, this pawn gets opened up when it comes back down after it's been attacked okay got to think about the position that we're in at the moment because we're wanting to push this pawn up but the knight's going to be taking our pawn here so is there something else that we can do in the meantime we could push this pawn or we could push it here to try and release the bishop supporting this pawn some things to think about obviously the opponent's looking for the cheapy with the bishop here getting the queen across here so we have to be mindful of what we're potentially giving away it looks like he's um kind of trying to prevent this action somehow but we can do the on pass on just to get rid of that but he's also give his bishop space so there's probably no point in rushing now pushing this pawn sorry this pawn onto the bishop so we could push this pawn onto the knight but the knight does still have an escape room or we could just do on pass on but then it has two linked pawns in the center we need to be focused maybe on getting rid of the head of the snake or we go for the lockdown if we go for the lockdown the head of the snake usually gets chopped off anyway doesn't it uh, but it gives them less options because if we do go here on pass on then it takes back then it's got a little bit of a tiny cluster of pawns in the center of the board do we really want that bishop can come out here to attack the queen but like we said he wants this cheap position here whereby then they can go here so i'm quite interested in this position do i lock down i'm going for the lockdown it seems to give us a better type of position where the opponent has to go backwards or yeah so they've gone backwards and they've not got many spaces to jump to so they're going to have to readjust but like i've always said the head of the snake can always be challenged it's blocked his bishop in at the moment so he's going to be panicking to basically get this pawn out so we could continue with the pawn pushing up so we're going to push up mindful that our rook is not defended so we might have to bring the bishop here to support with the next rear through to their queen because this pawn will be looking to take this pawn or they may go for a lockdown so we can push onto the bishop at this moment so the bishop probably is going to escape then we can push and get a fork here with the pawn onto the knight and the bishop so that's continued pressure with a focused strategical type of play so the bishop has it had to take eventually anyway so now the pawn is on the knight the knight doesn't have many squares to jump to uh, okay and they've resigned the knight doesn't have any squares to jump to really because that's blocked that's blocked that's blocked only place it can go to is here so it's going to get captured 